Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It is officially time that I start preparing for my trip to Europe and so this is basically going to be a vlog getting ready with me. I am going to be taking you guys to Target with me right now because I need to go grab some last minute stuff for my trip. We are four days away from our trip which actually is plenty of time. We haven't gone to Target for any of like our essentials and then we are taking our dogs to my friend's house so she can watch them while we're gone. So we need to go to the pet store and grab all their food and snacks and all of that. So it's gonna be a very busy vlog, but I feel like it could be a lot of fun to take you guys with me and seeing what it looks like to, to prep for an almost month long vacation to Europe. I'm so excited. I, we're gonna pack, we're going to go to Target, we're gonna do last minute errands and we're gonna do it all together. So honestly, first things first, it's, Let's go off to Target. Starbucks has been attained and we are at Target. Does anyone else just go to Target before a trip and buy like an abundance worth of clothes that you might just want to wear? Like our toiletries are just these and the rest are all clothes. Like what is wrong with us? It has been a few days since I've updated you. We actually spent the weekend driving up to my friend's house, um, which is in Georgia. She's watching her dogs for us, so we brought our doggies there this weekend and we stayed with them for a couple days and then drove home. Um, so now it is Monday, so we literally fly out tomorrow. I'm all ready for the day. I'm actually meeting up with friends today, this morning, um, because they are from California and they flew in to go to Disney World. Uh, and I wanted to make sure I saw them before my trip, so I'm gonna go have breakfast with them. At, we're gonna go to the boardwalk at Trattorio Alforno, which is one of my favorite places. And then immediately after that, I'm running to go get my nails done because we gotta have cute nails for the trip. So I'm all ready. I'm just wearing a dress from American Eagle, and this little like white top is also from American Eagle. I am so behind. I haven't packed. I haven't. I have semi outfit plan in my head only, but we have so much to do. We are cleaning our house today. We are packing. We leave tomorrow. It's a complete madness. So I'm gonna go get some breakfast because I'm gonna be running late shortly. Um, if I don't leave now, I'll be running late. So we're gonna go get some breakfast. Good start to the day. We'll get our nails done and I will see you guys after that. So I just got my nails done. Um, I just basically went straight from breakfast to here. Um, I <laughs> had the most interesting nail experience. Um, I'm not a picky person, but I picked a color and they put it on my nails. And the color I chose was like this really soft, neutral, nude color with sparkles. And they painted in my nails and it was like, gold gold sparkles and gold does not look good on my skin <laughs> they looked literally looked so bad they looked horrible i will insert a photo i don't know <laughs> anyways i will insert a photo right now if the photo works um but basically i hated them and so i had her put a color like on top because like take it off like i never do this i hate my nails so much and I, I won't be able to get them done again, but I hate them. And here here they are. Um, I had her just put nude over it, but you can still see the gold sparkle underneath. They are, they are something, it's fine. It's gonna be fine. They're just fingernails. From afar, they look neutral. The lady who did my nails was incredibly nice, so I will never fault her, but the color that I chose versus the color that was on my nails, I even asked her to, I very politely asked her, she does not know I hate them, um, I very politely asked her to compare them and she goes, oh yeah, it's because your nails have blood vessels and therefore it changes the color, but like, this wasn't even blood vessels, okay, like this was bad, I don't know, I hope this isn't like, how my trip's gonna be. It is officially travel day. 
I am so excited. There's so much to do. I just took one of those really nice long showers, the ones where you like put your hair in a hair mask, where you put a face mask on, all the good things you shave. You just know you're not gonna feel clean in like 24 hours. So you're gonna do everything you can to get as clean as you can. So all I have on my face right now is skincare. I have zero like makeup or anything and I'm just gonna let like my skin breathe and soak. And I honestly will do a very, very light makeup for the flight. I'm probably just gonna put tinted moisturizer and mascara on. I'm about to throw on my travel outfit though, which is actually just like a very like light linen shirt and some leggings. Nothing super cute, nothing super fancy. So I'm gonna go get changed and I'm gonna take my hair out of my towel so it can kind of finish air drying and continue on our day. We've packed a little bit more, um, but still not fully packed. We're leaving for the airport in like four hours. So I do have a lot to do, but we have enough time to do it all. Okay, we are on our way to the airport, don't worry. I am not driving. Um, all our stuff is safely tucked in the back and there's a lot of traffic, but we are out, we are on our way. I am so sorry that I didn't share as much as I wanted to as, as far as my packing process goes. I wanted it to be like more like kind of showing you the outfits, but I guess it'll leave a little bit of a surprise for what I'm gonna wear at Star Wars Celebration. Um, in general though, the rest of my outfits are pretty neutral. You'll see a lot of like blacks and cream just stuff that I can rewear that won't be too obvious like no not really any bold patterns or prints I'm gonna be sitting stressed in the car until we get there because of course um, until I get through security I feel like for most people you're just sitting stressed and like waiting to forget everything thankfully we're going to a place where we can always buy more clothes if we forget them or whatever but I just hope the flight goes smooth I hope traveling goes smooth and I will see you guys when I get to the airport We made it to the airport. We're just going up to the terminal. Are you excited? Very excited. We made it through security and now we're just grabbing a bite to eat. Um, I have the priority of pass that which allows us to go into lounges, um, but there's no lounge in this terminal. So we get like a really big discount on our check. Um, so now that we've made it through, our flight isn't for two hours. So we're gonna have dinner and get this journey started. I got a grilled cheese and it has goat cheese in it. And so I'm really excited. Hayden got a grilled chicken sandwich and then we got some salmon toast for an appetizer. We're on the plane. Ready to take off it? It's a little greasy. It's gonna be a long flight. 